everybody, welcome back to another 944 video. Parts are starting to roll in. I got some new pedal pads, and this is an emblem, uh, what is it, gasket, I guess they call it. I guess when they repainted this car, either the old one fell apart or whatever, they lost it, but the, the gasket is missing. So I'm gonna put that on second, but first I'll do the pedal pads. I also got a couple other trim pieces I didn't bother to show because they just snapped on. A couple of these handles. Got this trim new and this handle and the metal bracket inside. Got them all from Pelican Parts. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, won't really be able to show it, but pop off those old uh, pads down there. At least the brake is worn. And uh, Pop these on. Okay, well that took probably 10 minutes to try to finagle these on around the metal, but they're on, they look good. This one was definitely worn out in a couple pieces. Much better. I always replace those on all my cars. Just, uh, it looks better. That's a safety thing. I mean, your foot's gonna slip off of that. It's very slippery. Moving on to the hood emblem here. Now I think the way that I have to do this, uh, there are, let's see, one, two, three, four uh, screws right here. I think I have to remove those and gently fold this up so I can access the back of it. There are some holes under here, but there are baffles. So you you can't reach it and there's no way to reach it inside the bumper. Right? So this is the only way to do it that I know of. So. When this car was repainted, they uh, this is supposed to be black right here, but they ended up painting this part. And there was a piece of Velcro on there, I assume was from maybe like an old bra from back in the day. Well, I pulled that off and it pulled the paint off. So another one of my projects, I'm gonna restore this back to the black strip. But this is, this is all just coming off. So anyway, let me, let me redo these and see if I can get the two fasteners that are on the back of this emblem so I can remove it. Well, I decided I wasn't uh, comfortable trying to bend this back as much. So there's a couple eight millimeter fasteners. There's one under here, and one under the other side. You have to uh, put the headlights up to get to it. So I'm gonna go ahead and remove those and then remove the entire panel. And you can see this Headlight is broken, but I've got new lights. It'll be installed in a different video, so stay tuned for that. Okay, well, after looking at this, I decided I didn't really need to take this front panel off, so I didn't bother with those two. I just put them back on. Um, these tabs on the back of this, this is just a pressure fit that is held on in these little rubber grommets right there. And so I just got a rag and a screwdriver and a piece, uh, well, actually some painters stir sticks. And this, with a little pressure, this popped right out. So I'm gonna clean that under there and then I can put the gasket on and then just press this back in place. A lot easier than I expected. Here's a gasket I was talking about. So this just kinda fits over this and this is a genuine Porsche gasket. I read that a lot of the aftermarket ones didn't seem to fit but uh, this is an OEM part and I think it was nine bucks whereas the other ones were like two or three dollars so I did splurge on this a little bit anyway I'm gonna go ahead and do this and pop it back on and now that I think about it it wasn't even a reason to remove those screws because all you had to do was just pry this out I thought it was held in with some nuts or something on the back but apparently not all done it actually ended up being Probably a lot easier than I would have thought. But getting this gasket on was a bit of a challenge, trying to fit it while pressing down, pressure around the whole thing at the same time. But I did get it. It's nice and even all the way around. And I'm pretty happy with that. So I guess that'll do it for this short video. Lots more coming up, stay tuned. Drop a comment down below, let me know what you think. 
It may not look like it. I mean, this car is in pretty good shape, but there's lots of stuff to do. Got the wheels to tackle. I think I may try to polish those at first. I don't think they've ever been buffed and polished, but I know the center caps definitely need to be painted. To clean the inside of the, uh, the drums, or the, the barrels, I should say. To clean all the brakes off, the calipers and everything. Maybe paint them red, who knows? Lots more to do. So let me know what you think. Until next time, we'll catch you on the flip side. Oh, 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 oh,